All right, summer wardrobe, check, done. Classic summer dessert, coming right up. Is there uh, one pudding that undoubtedly pairs together perfectly? It's jelly and it's custard. They come together, they've always gone together, surely. And it's one of those nostalgic desserts that brings back so many memories, I'm sure, for most of us. Michaela is now gonna show us how to make, get this, a Clover Classic Jelly and Custard Trifle Square. Not just one of them, but many of them, <laughs> using something that I've never seen used in a trifle before. Banana bread. I know. I was also like, yeah. Ooh, banana bread. I love banana bread. I know. You keep going on about know, how you're going to tank just, it when we're I know. This is it, but it's calling to me. It seems like, I want to get in. I know. The smell is just so strong. Like, oh, I can try it from beautiful. here. Oh, it's beautiful. It's delicious. It's this. lovely. But the, this is about a lot of different classic combinations. Speak of a classic, the Clover Classic is lovely. You can have it on its Ooh. own. You can pair it with fruit. You can pair it with jelly. You can pair it in a trifle. You can pair it with chocolate. You can do whatever you want. Or you can just pour it in a big fat glass and, and drink, drink it. it. Simple as that. We love it. And we are using the vanilla flavored um, Clover Classic custard. The OG. The OG for an OG kind of recipe that we are sprucing up slightly. This so, is what's from the like deal the 1950s. here? Yeah, no, this, this smacks of nostalgia for me. <laughs> this is Were very you born cool. then? Oh, I might have been. I might have been, okay. Um, <laughs> oh. You're frying our custard, basically. So, that's how the recipe um, starts. Now, what are you so, doing? Okay. So, it just did that because we kept the pan on. <laughs> Oh, don't you just love that? Yeah, man, you are... <laughs> this is a cathartic custard, custard recipe for you. I can just see you just let it out, man. Just go. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we're going to drink this. You can't, it like, is. It's a, a sound... No matter how mature you are, I, when I would, you hear something. No, completely. I, I think they should use that on, like, yeah, when they do on radio, those sounds, like, win 50 grand for figuring out what the sound is. That should be the next sound. Yes. Although, okay. would we win? I uh, no. Okay, so, so the we're custard's turning gone the custard in. into its own kind of jelly. Oh, wow. Yeah, so okay. we have two gelatin sheets here. You are dramatic with the food today. <laughs> you are squeegeeing the gelatin sheets. There's water spraying everywhere. <laughs> it's crazy out there. Okay, and you put that into the custard. It's important, yes, to bloom. Were you blooming the jelly in we there? We did bloom it. Okay. And now we're dissolving it in the custard. Okay. And I've already sliced some banana bread. You have? So could you please line that um, white I, I can, and I will. Thank you. Um, Oh, I love banana bread. I, you don't understand. I absolutely Are adore it. Are slices sufficient? I don't, Does that end one fit? It, Maybe slice a different. I'm gonna, one. I'm gonna fill that little gap there with one more. When it comes to filling pans, it needs to be done perfectly. You, you want no more real estate left out there, hey? Okay, yeah, you did that well. Whoa, I'm so impressed. Okay, so th it's not going to come out exactly like squares. One of them is going to be a little bit of giant, but that looks great. And there's still enough left over for us well, to nibble on afterwards. What do you mean, us? I'm still fasting. You, oh, oh you I'm sorry. I'm time. so sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay, so you allow the gelatin to dissolve. Okay, it which it has. Yet. And uh, does that require the heat? It does. To, okay. Otherwise, you will just end up with custard and sheets of gelatin. Gelatin, okay. <laughs> Which kind of looked like what was happening, but I think it's they're now almost... now starting to do it. So yeah. Cool. Ooh. Beautiful. And then we have some... I think it's the strawberry one. Uh-huh. Strawberry flavoured jelly. Uh-huh. Excuse the bits that decided to get hard at the bottom. Okay. And what you will end up doing is taking this custard flavoured jelly, okay. pour it over the banana bread. Okay. So I think As that's you are going to do right nice. now. Yes! Oh. This is actually getting more and more exciting the more. This is quite a dramatic trifle. Oh, uns. Okay. Are oh, you right there? Yeah. Okay. It's quite a heavy saucepan. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Okay, so... Oh, it's got that beautiful sheen and gloss. Beautiful. Let this set, presumably. For about half an hour or so. Okay. Yeah. And then you take the other gelatin, once that's set, and you pour this over. Ooh, okay. Then top it off with some Would you of need to food. let that set again? Yes. And then, so another half an hour in. So this you have to do in stages. You do. Okay. So you would let this set, then put the other one on, and top it off with some fruit so that the fruit actually fuses into, into the, the jelly. jelly. Ooh, I love that. And then, once it's done, you slice it, you put dollops of beautiful cream on it, and your 
choice of topping. I had a moment this morning and I said, I don't really eat chocolate with my trifle. Mm. I don't like the combination of chocolate with fruit. Okay. In honesty. So I right. would have substituted that with like Nuts. roasted almonds. Yeah, see, oh, I like that. Roasted sized almonds. I think almonds. a texture in this space, because it is quite a creamy, you know, you want something with a bit of bite. So I yes. think the textural element is ideal. Can I take the spoon and go and taste it? Of course. Um, you can find this amazing recipe on expressoshow.com. I'm going to tell you how amazing it is right now. Try and get a little taste of absolutely everything. I thought you didn't like trifle. Mmm, I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Do you hate that? Oh, that's lovely. The banana bread makes it. Never again <laughs> shall you make a trifle without banana bread. I'm okay, telling you. Okay, but you have to have another bite now because... Okay, I will with a little bit of peach. This is absolutely beautiful. Jo, I'll stress that again. Um, Expressoshow.com is where you can find all of this brilliance or you can find Michaela online and ask her why she doesn't like chocolate with fruit. Mmm. <laughs> Mm -hmm. So, we've well, had it. classic fashion from Timby, classic cars, thanks Chad, and we've seen classic hairstyles. And you, Michael? Classic. A classic range from Clover. Timeless taste. Made with love by Clover.